back to my channel so we could be checking out Struggle Jeans. God, we need you right now. And you know I've been off of the music reactions for a while now because I do have reasons for that. I think for the most part the reason why I don't, well, you don't see me react to any music reactions anymore because, you know, I'm trying to avoid claims and all that though, but y'all know how I do. But I think for the most part, we will be checking out some of his stuff since I got a request. So, here you go. I like the part where he said that the world is getting crazy. It is getting crazy every day. I don't want to get political in this reaction video because I think both sides are either terrible as presidents. But to me, I'm just a person that calls it like I see it. You know, I'm not with the leftists. I'm not with the rightists. I'm just split in the middle. I'm just a person that calls it like I see it. Because the world is getting crazier and crazier. And the pandemic is even worse because there are more people out here getting COVID every single day. So I think for the most part, we do need God in this moment right now. Educate, look at what's going on, let it resonate, accelerate Find your inner hunger like you never ate Agenda is to push the hate Separate and segregate, don't celebrate quite mm. The part where he said Separate the congregate Okay That one is a hard line for me to progress Because I think at this point the government is really dividing everybody, you know, and it's just a sad situation to see, but ain't nothing we can, you know what, there is something we can do. Come together and get along. You know, whether you're black, white, Asian, Hispanic, it don't matter what race you are. We all need to just get along, you know what I'm saying? And that's the way I see it. Because one, I'm a Christian and I love everybody with, with all colors. The storm is coming to for heaven's sake. The violence that they demonstrate, instigate and penetrate. The values of our country and our God is what they desecrate. My fighters ain't no featherweight. Pulling out the seams of the fabric that they fabricate. They feed us lies, manipulate, intimidate through fear and force. Forcing us to sit and wait until we come together, congregate, and then we liberate. The way that he raps in this track, I love his aggression and his own style and take on life. So with that, I respect you for that. And that you give me strength to find some love amongst the hate. Marching on these streets of blood till I see the golden gates. Troubadour, troubled souls, one of God's servants. Blades out, cut the grass till we see the serpents. One day, I hope you see the truth. This puppet show stays on because of you fools. She said, we've been dancing with the devil for so long. This is exactly what I see every day, the news and in person. Why do you think there's so many people making Karen videos all the time? Because you got people that act like Karens, ain't got no sense. They have no choice but to give the name of Karen because the way they be acting on camera, we do have the right to record you based on the lack of accountability for your actions. And let's not forget the industry of how the industry is messing up people's minds. Because if you walk away with a million dollars, then you're all set. You don't need to get that rich to be a mega star in Hollywood because they want to manipulate your mind into thinking that you're supposed to make everyone feel irrelevant. May I say more? One day they finally see the truth. 
You know, I like her voice, though. I feel like what she's basically telling us is that the world needs God right now because it's like you look at the media and uh, the five news. I don't think they ever talk about God or anything whatsoever, you know, on their show or whatever, though, because they want the world to think that, yeah, you know about Mother Nature, but they don't really know God as a whole. Because why he was the one that created Earth. He created everything. So apparently, the way I look at the world is, you look at certain people, you can tell that they're lost souls. Like it's like they're it's like their souls have been so lost, so far away. They just lose track on life in general. Because number one. They barely have that one guidance in their lives. And then once that person is not in their lives anymore, they turn to madness. Mm, talking about the media, I was just finished talking about it a few seconds ago. It's like you're watching the news and the media wants you to believe everything. But for me, I believe in God. You know what I'm saying? I believe, you know, anything what God says. But I don't believe what the media says because they want you to get a negative reaction. And they want to mess up your mind. It's, you know, to think that, yeah, the world is crazy. But what are they going to do about it? I mean, all we could do as human beings is to just pray and ask God for guidance. Because without that, we're nothing. We're doomed. So, I sometimes hate the media for creating a big issue out of nothing. Their objective, but I got a lot of questions. How these kids molested, but nobody's been arrested. Credit in Okay, let's break it down about what he said right there about kids being molested and nobody has been arrested. Let's take a look at what happened in Hollywood with between Bill Cosby and Harvey Weinstein. Harvey Weinstein is a white guy who has been director for so many years. Many women have come forward, accused him of harassing them, assaulting them, and raping them and all that. But the problem is when Bill Cosby's issue came to light he was the one that got arrested he was the one that was in jail for god knows how long the guy was 80 years old when he was in jail blind man a blind man was in jail for for drugging and raping women when it comes to being black when you do something stupid you're gonna get life less sentence and do so much as a black person and that's the way, well, that's just how the world is nowadays. And we got so many cases of, you know, sexual abuse, child abuse, and nobody, you know, in that group are doing anything about it. And yet, when you explain to the authorities of what happened, they're not going to take you seriously. And that's just the worst part about it. They'll probably think that you're making up stuff, but... When you have real evidence to put that person away from what he did to you, then not only that you will become a survivor, but you're gonna have no choice but but you're gonna have no choice but to tell the whole world, you know, of what happened to you. And maybe just maybe they'll be able to understand and learn a thing or two about the experience that you went through. So yeah, I truly felt like you know. The people that are doing these horrific crimes are getting away with so much. So much. I, it's, it's like I could go on and on about this part. The testament these children are protected, so I'm fighting all these terrorists, both foreign and domestic. Refuse to be directed. Lying out of sheep. Only kneel to my God, so I'm dying on my feet. Oh, silence when we speak, but there's violence in the street. I've been rolling with the punches, I can't take it on the cheap. Uh, drink from a glass half full, I'm optimistic. He 
basically just told us what he's doing. It's, it's like he's doing God's work. You're protecting your sisters, your brothers and sisters. You're protecting people of color. You're protecting people of your kind. You're protecting people all over the world from all of this crazy nonsense. And yet you got people that are not a Christian, that is not religious. They will tell you some fake stuff about Christianity. Yeah, I mean, in times, Christianity people, they can be judgmental. But I think to me, as a Christian, I don't really do that. I don't discriminate people. If I see something wrong with you, I'm going to call you out and hold you accountable. But at the same time, I would never be that kind of person to discriminate somebody just based on their, you know, sexual preference, you know, their gender, their race. You know, I'm not that kind of person. So I think what he actually just said right there is that the more we do God's work, the more we continue to pray and continue to ask him for guidance, for strength and motivation. And we'll be the most, yeah, like real life heroes though, because we're doing God's work. And what he just said sums up everything into reason why I enjoy this video even more. Hey, I hope you see the truth. This puppet show stays on because of you fools. We've been dancing with the devil way too long. I know it's fun, but get ready to pay your dues. Oh, God, come back home. This crazy world is filled with liars and abusers. I sometimes feel like, yeah, you got your gospel singers and you have your regular artists doing gospel music, but are they really, you know, doing, well, basically just, you know, sending a message? Because I think once they finish doing, you know, gospel songs, they'll probably go back to making their regular music, which is fine. I have no problem with that. But I sometimes think that you don't see them talk about God, of how much they are blessed by him of uh, giving them God-given talents. Rather singing, rapping, dancing, do acting, doing art, whichever case may be, you barely hear people talk about what God gave them as gifts. Providing us with a good song and a good message about doing God's work and just protecting the people of any race in general. So my hat goes off to you. And shout out to him for doing a good job on this track. And we definitely broke down some of the things and I definitely spoke my piece on how it is in the world and Hollywood, you know, based on the stuff he said. 
And shout outs to the singer. She killed this track. Like, I felt the soul in my heart. I'm like, oh, man. If that doesn't get you emotionally, mentally, I don't know what to tell you, man. Shout out to the singer. Who oh, Caitlin Curtis, man. Shout out to Caitlin Curtis for doing a outstanding performance in this track. Y'all enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments down below. I'm out of here.